will be the king of wireless EV charging? Tesla, Volkswagen, Hyundai, or is it this kid? Also, what does it mean to be human? Get ready to stretch your answer. And next time someone calls you a smart mouth, Mouth.io will make you reply, thank you. All of that and more coming up on this edition of AC Spotlight. To be sure, EV charging wait times are no fun. The only thing worse is when there's no line at all because the thieves stole the copper. Upsetting trend seen all around the country with vandals and thieves targeting charging stations for electric vehicles. Help is on the way though, as wireless technology could help solve these challenges. Tesla is already testing wireless charging on its CyberCab with a wireless pad, while Hyundai is developing EV wireless roads, which might slow down range anxiety. And Volkswagen set a record by charging a Porsche to 50% in 10 minutes. Out of the three, who do you think will be crowned the wireless king? I'm betting none. My money's on the kid. He looks like he means business. Next. Oh baby, your skin feels so... Electric? Humanity is on the cusp of transcendence into transhumanism, where humans and technology physically and mentally merge as one. Researchers at the University of Chicago have developed a new hydrogel semiconductor that enables communication between living tissue and machines offering a soft, stretchable, and hydrated material ideal for implantable and non-surgical bioelectronic applications. Some potential applications include wound healing, but can amend a broken heart, wearable biosensors, and the crowd pleaser, dynamic electronic tattoos. With Hydro SC, your tattoo can change color, emit light, or display your latest bad decision in real time. And technology is not just merging with your skin, but giving us a mouthful as well. Coming up, MIT researchers give us something to smile about with the first customizable intraoral interface combining sensors and actuators for hands-free interaction and health monitoring. And it's a mouthful just saying that. But first, let's check out today's featured product spotlight, sponsored by Mauser Electronics. The analog device's AD4080 Differential SAR ADC is a high-speed 20-bit ADC designed for precision data acquisition. With a signal-to-noise ratio of 93.6 decibels and 40 million samples per second throughput, it ensures reliable performance at high frequencies. The ADC features low distortion, easy drive technology for reduced power consumption, and a continuous acquisition architecture that simplifies signal chain design. It includes integrated digital filtering, a 16 FIFO for efficient data transfer, and low drift reference buffers. The analog device's AD4080 is ideal for all of these applications and more that require high precision and latency. Head over to Mauser.com today to check them out or simply click the link in the description. When I was growing up, having a smart mouth usually brought on unfavorable consequences. But Aarhus University and MIT researchers are changing that. They have created Mouth.io, the first intraoral wearable device designed for hands-free interaction and health monitoring. Mouth.io resembles a dental retainer customized to fit the user's teeth and containing sensors and actuators to capture data on temperature, movement, and tongue touch, while also providing feedback via vibration and LEDs. Built from durable materials, it's structured to withstand forces far beyond typical bite strength. In testing, Mouth.io successfully alerted users to hypoesthesia, to hot beverages, and monitored jaw movement for teeth grinding detection. Researchers aim to enhance Mouth.io with wireless capabilities, envisioning it as a practical tool for health diagnostics, assistive tech, and accessible control interfaces for those with mobility limitations. Participants in the study rated Mouth.io's coolness factor at a six, and that's not too high. However, not to worry, I believe that was the same rating Parachute Pants got when they first came out. Hey, that does it for us. To stay updated on the latest in electrical engineering, be sure to check out our other videos, and we'll see you next time.